Uh, let's quickly look at another thing that um, you might experience when trying to like uh, palpate the abdomen. All right, it is known as rebound tenderness or muscle garden. Okay, and this could be seen in patients that have what an abdomen that is swollen up, is tender, okay, and um, it's painful. All right, so rebound tenderness and muscle guarding during palpation. All right, so this is how you palpate the abdomen. You'll be very technical about it. All right, uh, we're just trying to define rebound tenderness and what muscle guarding that will be seen during palpation. Basically, just differentiate between the two concepts. All right, so that you guys will know it in depth. So we say that. Rebound tenderness are and uh, uh, muscle guarding are important signs that the healthcare professionals look for during palpation, okay? And this is to access the abdominal tenderness, right? So we'll talk about rebound tenderness and talk about muscle guarding, okay? You marry the two knowledges together and you know the differences between the two concepts because they kind of like what? Uh, confused students, all right? So we say that rebound tenderness it's a sign of peritonitis. That's what inflammation of the lining of the abdominal cavity. All right. And um, it occurs when the examiner presses on the abdomen. Then when they suddenly release the pressure, it causes a sharp pain in the abdomen. Okay. When your hand is there, the pain is not there. Okay. When your hand is there, the pain is not there. But it's when you want to remove your hand, that's when the patient starts feeling crazy pain. Yeah, when you want to put your hand, they'll be feeling some pain. But when your hand is there now, they'll be relieved. But when you want to rebound, they start feeling crazy pain, all right? That's rebound tenderness, okay? And this indicates that there's what? Inflammation or irritation of the peritoneum, okay? And now, let's talk about muscle guarding now, okay? Muscle guarding is what? A voluntary contraction of the abdominal muscles to guard the area of pain okay so as you want to press the muscle there is now tensed up tensed up so that what the pain is reduced okay so that's muscle guarding the muscles they are kind of like guarding themselves on excessive pain okay they want to like reduce the pain and all that okay so this muscle guiding can it actually okay this causes the muscles to feel rigid or tense it can be a sign of underlying inflammation irritation or injury okay it may also indicate what appendicitis diverticulitis or, or any other condition that has to do with what inflammation and irritation okay so you see the differences between what rebound tenderness and muscle guarding rebound tenderness when you put your hand there the patient is relieved when you want to remove there's sharp pain okay muscle guarding as your hand is there the muscles are rigid to reduce the pain okay so that's just the difference between the two concepts all right so during palpation the healthcare professional would typically what press on the abdomen to access the tenderness release the pressure gently to check for rebound tenderness and feel for muscle guarding by palpating the abdominal muscle you want to see is it very stiff that's why sometimes you tell the patient, please release, release, the, release, release the, the pressure, release the pressure. But they can't release the pressure because it's what? The, the thing is like automatically brought in by the muscle just to protect itself, okay? So you do all these things just to know, just to access for what? The level of inflammation, infection, or injury or anything, okay? So that's it about what the differences between muscle tenderness and muscle guarding during palpation.